there. While we're working on new observations with new equipment, we want to share some unused footage from a few of our at-home observations. Here is the temperature at the start of the observation from two feet and from just above the surface, and the temperature from outdoors. We placed a couple of buttons at 14 feet and 18 feet from the viewer. The viewer height was one and one fourth of an inch above the surface. Here are the objects from the viewer's perspective. Notice how the button at 18 feet appears to be above the button at 14 feet. Here we crack the patio door. Notice how the distant button appears to sink. And as we further open the patio door, the button appears to sink completely below the floor horizon. Here is the time lapse of events. Here are a couple of other time-lapse observations from that night with the same setup. For this observation, we use different objects, rocks instead of buttons. For these next two observations, we viewed from the opposite side of the room. Instead of the objects being near the patio door, we placed the camera by the door and the objects by the opposite wall. Here we open the patio door. The same sinking effect occurs. Here's another look. For this last observation, we started with the patio door open and the distortion present. We tied a string to one of the buttons from earlier in the video. We had to lift the button in order to see it, as it appeared to be below the horizon. close the patio door and the air in the room evens out, the bottom of the objects and button come into view.
Here is the time lapse. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.